NRL.com is here with Brent Tate. Brent, you've been uh, selected for the Prime Minister's 13, first time round. How do you feel? Yeah, I'm really looking forward to it actually. Uh, you know, just over the years I've always spoken to guys that have been up to PNG and they always say it's a pretty much uh, once in a lifetime experience. So I'm looking forward to getting up there and seeing what it's all about and, and also hopefully, uh, I guess, pressing your claims for the end of your tour. That's right, it does have that reputation for the game that's the sort of trial before the World Cup. Um, so, you know, how much has that been a part of your thought? Yeah, it has been. Uh, you know, definitely, you know, want to go out there and play well, obviously. So, uh, yeah, look, I'm just, I'm really happy to be here. I always love being a part of the rep teams and, uh, you know, too happy to go out there and, like I said, just hopefully get up there, play well and see what happens after that. Pressure's on with um, with the coach and, and co-coach co there uh, watching you along the tour? Oh, yeah, definitely. I think, uh, you know, Obviously, Tim being there shows how seriously you know they're taking the game, and uh, obviously you know you don't want to go out there and perform badly. So um, you know there's a fair bit of expectation on it, but you know we're all used to that, and we're all looking forward to it. Um, it'll be the first game, uh, the, or the last game actually you'll play before the World Cup if you're selected. Um, you know how important is it that you really press your claim, and and what are you hoping to achieve from this game? Yeah, look, I just want to go out there and play well. Uh, you know, obviously, uh, it, you know, as, as we said before, it, you know, it is about pressing your claims and uh, doing your best. And and, and, it, and if it is the last game before you go on tour, you know, it is important you get a decent hit out because it'll be a few weeks, uh, you know, before playing again. So, uh, you know, there's plenty at stake, and there's. Uh, Plenty of pressure there, but you know we're all used to that, and we've all you know dealt with that before. So just, I really, I'm just looking forward to getting up there and playing well. And like I said before, fingers crossed, uh, names right out that back end of the year. What have you heard about the uh, Papua New Guinea and rugby league players? Have you spoken much about the guys uh, to the guys that have been about the ones that you'll play against? Oh, look, I've played them a few times here in Australia, and uh, I've always found it extremely hard. So I can only imagine what what the faces are over there. So. Uh, you know, they always say it's really physical. You know, it's a you know pretty tough environment with the heat and uh, obviously the crowd. And you know, they're uh, you know they're, they're they're tough to play at the best of times, especially at home. So you know, it's going to be a big match. And you know, the last couple of years they've done really well. So you know, we'll we'll have to we'll have to be going up there, the good frame of mind, and play well. That's for sure.